Okay, we have time to get one character going. So who wants to volunteer to lead this one through? Oh, I know it was sarcasm, right? Suggest a build. You, if you want to suggest a build, you have to be one of the 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 view, you have to be a member of the viewer group. Which means you volunteer to die. Scorch we had before is this the one? Cast area effects spells with harming. Oh, without harming stuff. Elven nimbleness. Elves in your party gain a bonus on initiative rolls equal to their character level. Crashing Tailwind. All party members gain a plus one bonus for every five character levels to damage rolls with bludgeoning weapons. Hmm. So run around to all elves or want weapons? Bonus on initiative rolls equal to your level. So by the time we... It's actually... So you get to go first. Plus one bonus for every five character levels to damage rolls with bludgeoning weapons. The Flesh Eater Barbarian. Yeah. Welcome to Randomness Ring. So this is plus one bonus to every five character levels, minimum plus one to damage levels. So, so figure at best it's only going to be plus four damage. And at level 20, who freaking cares about four damage? Right? Unless it's... Or is the damage per character? It says character level. So is that everybody's character level? So if you have two characters, it'll be plus two? Plus four is not bad with Tailwind. It's, well, I agree. <laughs> I'm not saying it's good. But I have our choices here. <laughs> we don't really have a lot of choices. <laughs> With Glacial Dirge, Druids, Elemental Rampage. Oh, the specific classes. I uh, hate that. It'd be better if it wasn't specific archetypes. Going Fireballs Blazing. We do that anyway. The problem with Fireballs Blazing is the fire resistance that they have. Well, I guess fire resistance doesn't matter if you have everybody that's throwing the fireballs does fire ascendancy, right? Is Elven Nimbleness exclusive to elves? It is. All elves in your party. It had they have to be elves. That isn't a column. So scorched earth, but it's got to be specific. Celestial Thurge, Druid, Elemental Rampager, Eldritch Scion, Overwhelming Mage, Elemental Witch, Elemental Specialist. Crashing hmm. Tailwind is just, yeah. Yeah, it's, it, it's 
Scorched Earth. These two aren't. I'm not really impressed with plus one bonus to damage every five levels. That's not that much. By the time you get to level 20, that's not even noticeable. Plus four at 20 is not noticeable. So who wants to go first? Who wants to pay the price? Oh, sorry, who wants to be the first to uh, lead your group 11? We need to do this fairly quick because it's end of the stream. <laughs> so. No volunteers? Ring? Saw me? Fanny? Lurkers? Ring? Ring Mage is a strong blaster caster, probably the best. Not you. Fanny. Fanny has to be here to be listening, though. Zombie leads? I think zombies should lead, too. Grim, you're volunteering? Grim is the cool viewer, I can tell. Okay, I'll go back and pick out a portrait later. So, what do you want to be, Grim? Classes. If you want to participate in the tailwind with the, the fire, well, throwing stuff around and not hurting friendlies. Overwhelming mage, elemental witch, celestial dirge, elemental specialist. There's another one, too. Oh, they added new Eldritch Scion. Which one's Eldritch Scion? Magus. Okay. Okay, Eldritch Scion. Was I don't remember. It could it could have been. Wouldn't doubt it. Not that you want to be one. You don't have to be one. Just be whatever you want. No, no, no. Grim can do what he wants. I want to be a crazy, dual-wielding, stabby person. So that would be um, a rogue. Anybody, actually. Be a slayer? Do you want to be a slayer, Grim? You can do dual-wielding, stabby with that and be pretty good at it. Okay. Gimpy, I am sorry to say this, Don't listen to her. but it is time to end the stream. Say goodbye to all of the nice people and make sure you tell them to have a great day or evening. We will see them again tomorrow. Also, make sure to remind them to hit the follow button and visit your YouTube channel. Focus killer. What kind of slayer are we looking at? Regular slayer? Gonna go regular Slayer unless somebody corrects me. So, what's Vanguard? I don't know. Oh, Vanguard is um, Battlefield Commanders focus on the brutality of combat and lead their allies to bloody victory. Quick to react to danger, Vanguard is a valuable scout, capable officer, and skilled tactician. Basically, they give up their Slayer talents for teamwork stuff. So, if you want to be a good leader, you'd be a Vanguard. Base layer it is. 
and race, human, dwarf, elf, male, female. And fear. Half work. Human. Male, female. Male. Mixing it up this time. Half dwarf, half damn fear. So that would be one quarter vampire? Okay, background. The See you, Ring. Thanks for watching. Don't worry, we'll build the rest of the group next week. We just have to get this first character done, then we'll be good to go. So you won't be a street urchin with the pickpocket, so. Outdoor resource, but okay, fine, mess me up. Uh, resourceman. And it would be pokey pokey stabby stabby, right? Half dwarf, half damphir, and the last half vampire. That's a lot of extra limbs. Pokey pokey stabby stabby, okay. So do you have anything in particular here? Needs charisma. Probably not the smartest thing to do here. I'm just playing with numbers, unless you have something specific. Grim, I just goofy now. Yeah, this is ouch on the strength. I'm just goofing around with stuff because he's not telling me stats, so I'm just throwing stuff around. I could just do this. Just all around her except for the decks. Okay. Of constitution, so we can die not as fast. Okay, how is this, Grim? Is this acceptable? You get some bonuses with the intelligent. You get some extra skill points here and better willpower stuff. Blah blah blah. Fine, cool. Okay, so skills. We're gonna want uh, mobility, trickery, stealth. I don't care. Perception. We don't do stealth. Uh, over that area, in case somebody else doesn't do it later. Get those. Yeah, that should be fine. So, pokey pokey. Weapon finesse. Well, stealth really only really works if the whole party does it, I think. If, if the whole party doesn't do it, I don't think it's really worth it. And even then, in this game, it's kind of goofy. So. Oh, you get another. F All right. Weapon finesse. Weapon focus. But which weapon? Kukri's? Gotta be Kukri's. If you're not using Kukri's, you're not doing it right. Or short swords are like too. Weapon focus, yes. Two wield short bows. That's not well actually being the half dwarf, half damn fear, half vampire, that might work because you do have a couple extra arms. That might work. Scroll down, okay. So finesse weapons, dagger. Doing sort of finesse, isn't it? Draw the stroke string with his teeth. Yes. But 
Punching dagger. Dueling sword? Is that is that really a finesse weapon? No, I, I'm not sure. Is dueling sword a finesse weapon? As in you can do that? I just want to double click. Because I'm guessing we're dual wielding. Although we don't have to. I'm guessing we're dual wielding. It is, but it's not a light weapon. Oh. So are we Harbinger, are we planning on doing How are we planning on doing this? Darn, yeah, I know. An asset, but you get an extra minus two for dual wielding it. Yeah. So basically, you want to, if we're dual wielding, we want to stick to light weapons like the Kukri, Rapier, Short Sword, Dagger, Punching Dagger. Rapier? Okay. Oh, rapier! Rapier's not a, a light weapon. Oh shit! <laughs> so they don't let you do wield with, a, say, a rapier and a dagger. That doesn't count. Or can you? you if you do dual da rapiers, bad. But is a rapier and a dagger okay? Because it's a light weapon. With a minus two, so that's but that's normal. Okay. As long as the offhand is light. Thank you. Wasn't sure how that worked. So you want to do that, Harbinger? Go with the rapier and in, in your main hand and dagger or so, have a light weapon of some kind in the off. Or you can just do two lights and not take the penalty at all. Can you? Oh, do a wheel, dueling sword and a dagger. So how about dueling sword and a dagger? Just to be different. Duel and a dagger? Okay. That'll be the plan. Duel, dual sword and a dagger. Okay, do you want a deity? Yeah, a, a, the dual sword and some light weapon, whatever. We'll, yeah, we'll, when we get to that, we're not there yet, so. As far as the deity goes, anyone special? Keep in mind, this is only affects your alignment, which really doesn't matter. Let's pick it up with Asmodeus. Cool, Asmo. He never gets any love. Alignment. Dueling sword and great crossbow. Too bad great crossbows aren't in the game. Lawful neutral, lawful evil, or neutral evil. Hey, none of the smiting good's gonna work on you. That appearance. Do we care? Use the great crossbow to shoot dueling swords. That may work. Don't care about that much. Me neither. We do it my way. So, voices, confidence. Slice! Behead! Our time has come. We'll change the portrait here in a second. This is my path. My skills exceed yours. I lead. You follow. We will be victorious. Ah, entertainment. Beautiful. Combat is adjourned. A mere flesh wound. Wise. Wise. I will guide. Okay, we'll go back and pick a... Portrait, custom, so it's human, roguish, so. That looks like a dueling sword, right? <laughs> she thought I was serious. More human alt sword lord. Oh, so which one is that? 
Is, is there a portrait for that? Which one's the Aldori sword board? Is he a custom one, or is he on one of the, the first ones, the defaults? I never use these, so I don't know who they are. That's Amagus. This idea, oh, behind the look, okay. That's an Inquisitor. You did it wrong. This is how you do it. Warg. Please excuse me. That was embarrassing. I meant to say. Jag. Where are the humans go? Humans. Human males, where are you? This is important stuff, so we gotta get this right. Sparkly hands, less sparkly hands. I guess you're not going to be wearing the heavy armor, so that's really not going to fit, is it? You see ones. Which one? Which one will do? I'll stop moving. Which one? I'm guessing this one? Based on stream delay, maybe? This one? Okay. There's that. We don't care about the appearance because stuff did that. Name. Grand Arbinger. All set? All set. So it comes to this. Kind of fits the name, too, huh? Okay, so that's going to be the leader of viewer group 11. So we'll, we'll get the number, another member of the party. Um, oh, that's right. Start off with an extra level, but we'll take care of that next week. So we'll get him parked over here and ready for next week. And uh, we'll get uh, Grim up to level 2. And we'll pick up a second person, too, as well. And then we'll pick up a third person quickly after uh, the first island. So that's how that works. So again, congratulations, viewer 10, or view group 10 for not dying. Somehow we pulled it off. It happened. You're the best leader. I won't need you to your dad. Hopefully. Hopefully. So anyway, like I said, we'll pick up a uh, view group or two new members next week. And again, continue from here. So thank you all very much for watching. Have a, let's see. So stream schedule next few days. Tomorrow is Monday, so we're going to do some uh, World of Warcraft Classic. Tuesday is Baldur's Gate 3. Wednesday, For the King 2 with Jeff and Hurricane. Thursday, Rogue Trader. Friday is Celasta Multiplayer with Hobo, Hurricane, and Jeff. 
Saturday, more World of Warcraft Classic, and then next Sunday, back here to Pathfinder Wrath of the Righteous, where the first half of the stream is campaign stuff with Kimpy the Dwarven Crusader Angel. Currently very late into Act 5. We should be starting Act 6 next Sunday, fingers crossed. Finish up that run, and then uh, Rogue Trader will take the early slot on Sundays after that's done. But viewer groups will stay a lot around with the uh, Treasure of the Midnight Isles. So that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Tomorrow's stream starts at noon Pacific, 3 p.m. Eastern, 8 p.m. GMT for some more World of Warcraft Classic. So thank you very much for watching. Have a great evening, great day, wherever you happen to be. Stay safe, stay healthy, and I will see you tomorrow.